Good morning. Welcome to What's Up Monday. It is April 8th and wow, we've got lots of great stuff for you guys today. First and foremost, as always, our life skill, belief, is having a yes I can attitude. And a great example of that would be this past weekend. Uh, we made the announcement and posted the video that we are now officially joining Mastery as a brand and will be merging into that and the full explanation about that in that video. But if that is not an example of a yes I can attitude, I don't know what is. Uh, so the background behind that is Mastery has 11 schools. We will be the 12th school joining them. And uh, Mr. Horton has never... Uh, asked anybody to partner or join their program in 26, well, no, sorry, 31 years of running uh, his business. And so uh, we are the first to be offered that opportunity and uh, definitely very excited for all of the things that will be coming up for it. But uh, I knew uh, the very first time I went to Rhode Island for uh, the Legacy Weekend as a brand new coaching client, uh, right away, it was, yep, <laughs> this is what I've been looking for for years. And so since then, I've been trying to model it as much as possible. And uh, we got so close and so good at it that uh, we are actually now a mastery brand. So that is definitely a yes, I can attitude, seeing that in 31 years, nobody outside of mastery has, uh, has become a partner before. So super excited for that. Uh, again, in the other video, we talked a lot about what it was or, or uh, the benefits. One of the things, for example, uh, well, actually a couple. The one that we wanted to talk about today was the Black Belt Tracker. That is a mastery app. Uh, so we have access to it now that we are a mastery school. So I sent out the email, talked about it in the video. You can download it for both Android and or Apple and start using it to uh, help your child behave and get things done at home to be a better black belt at home. Uh, the second thing that I didn't mention was they have a full parkour system. And so uh, we know that all of the kids love uh, running, jumping, and climbing. So I'm going to work at how we can introduce that uh, into our program here. So the only restriction at the moment is uh, the, the height of the ceiling in the school. Since it's only about eight feet, uh, there's not a ton of room to do any jumping. So I am working on solving that issue so that we can introduce uh, parkour and have the kids do a whole bunch of awesome things uh, in the coming months. So looking forward to that, but believe having a yes I can attitude, step number one, leadership training is uh, nunchaku, finish the form. You have moves 15 through 20. Want to see you test uh, successfully at that at belt testing in two weeks. So make sure that you are practicing and we are gonna then start working on adding the music into it. Uh, this week the is uh, actually we're going to do again a, a, a blending. So you're going to see for the next several weeks or months, things are going to be converging or blending in the Facebook group. Uh, one of the benefits of Mastery is they do a Blue Stripe Challenge every single week. So I posted all of April's challenges uh, in the group and your child is welcome to accept all of them or some of them and uh, and get extra blue stripe challenges. But this week we're going to also go to a yellow stripe. So this will be yellow stripe number two. Yellow stripe is personal development. What is something right now your child's not doing or not doing very well? Work on it. And then in three to five days, turn in a yellow stripe form and they can earn a second yellow stripe. So on the table this week would be a blue stripe and a yellow stripe as we start to merge into more of exactly what mastery does. Uh, number four, we have three weeks until belt testing. Belt testing is April 29th and 30th. So if you are not able to make either one of those dates, please let me know right away and we can talk about the makeup exam and what needs to happen. Uh, dun, 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 dun. Let's see, we already talked about, we are now a Mastery Martial Arts program and the Black Belt Tracker app. So those were good. Uh, the next part, with, uh, with our onboarding process, Mrs. Merrill is now onboarding new members when they join. And so we need the Zoom link that we use for virtual classes in order to do that. So there will be a switch. We will not be doing virtual class anymore, but what you can do is if your child completes, 
If your child completes a workout at home, you can record it and post it in the Facebook group and that will equal a credit for class. So while they're not able to join us virtually live, they can still do a workout at home and get credit for that. So that, that way the benefit is still there. We're just gonna have to change the uh, delivery part of that. Uh, bum, bum, bum. So talking about the, uh, oh, that was a fun one. I had dinner with mom and dad on Sunday as I always do. And uh, mom was talking about the uh, disposable senior community. And uh, what she was referring to is in American culture, as people tend to get older, uh, they, they seem to get pushed aside, left forgotten, uh, and, uh, and it's not a great, great system. And so uh, it's pretty much only here in America. Uh, almost every other culture takes care of their elderly very well. And so she was talking about that now that she's in her 80s, so is my father, and, uh, and things are becoming more challenging for them. And so she's talking about how this is a challenge and this is a problem. Technology is difficult because it's changing all the time and moving fast for them. Uh, they have a hard time understanding. Um, she suffers from arthritis now. And so there's a lot of things that she's not able to do. So talking about, uh, or, or what brought all of this up was, she was really impressed with all of the pictures and videos of having the kids help around the house. Having the children help the family at a younger age teaches them the appreciation and the help at you know when mom and dad get older and that you still should and need to help your parents so uh, she thought that that was a good message to be giving to the kids and she definitely appreciates having access to christy and i whenever she needs something uh, and uh and so that is a good thing to teach your kids you know help out now and you always take care of family. So for the first, what, zero to three years, parents took 100% care of the infant. Well, return the favor. When your parents need your help as they get older, you definitely want and should always be there. Uh, then the last thing in leadership training, uh, gave one of the uh, mottos or quotes that I live by, and the parents uh, asked me to, to reiterate that here, and uh, they were writing it down so that they could use it. And it goes like this. Your failure to plan does not constitute my emergency. And so this is a, a great motto because it relieves an awful lot of stress on anything when your kids don't plan properly. So in a classic example would be it's bedtime, right? And or, you know, it's Sunday night even at seven or eight o'clock at night and your child says, I have a project due tomorrow. And so at that point, I hear the horror stories of parents are, are up all night and running to the store and getting everything and getting it all done and getting it turned in. Nope. I'm sorry. I guess you're going to get a zero on that. Your failure to plan does not constitute my emergency. I am not going to stay up all night tonight to take care of the project that you had weeks or a month to do. Right? You make them face the consequence at that point. They go to the teacher sorry, I didn't do it, then it's still a follow-up. They don't get out of the project. What can I do or may I have an extension would be one question, right? What can I do to make up for this would be another question. Third value would be you still do the project and you turn it in late, even if you get a zero. So you're still teaching your child, you do the work that's required of you, even if it's late, because that's what you do. So one more time, your failure to plan does not constitute my emergency. Feel free to, to swipe that, use that, and it definitely helps reduce your stress. So that's everything that's happening this week. So once again, real quick, life skill, belief, having a yes, I can attitude. We are now a mastery martial arts school that we will be spending the next several months merging and combining in. Uh, for those of you that don't know, just real quick, uh, we've been... 90% mastery for the last two years. It's just everything that's been happening. I've been rebranding as prestige because uh, as being a coach, a coaching client of Mr. Horton's, I was allowed to do that. Now we can take out that, uh, that step and we can add that last 10%. So it's not really going to be a huge change for you guys uh, other than some really awesome stuff like the, por the parkour, uh, the uniforms, the Amazon store, all the stuff that I talked about in the other video. 
Uh, this week, yellow stripe number two for the students, plus bonus blue stripes are now available. Belt testing is in three weeks. Belt tracker, your black belt belt, uh, your black belt tracker app. Wow, that's a mouthful. Uh, is now available. Get that downloaded and start using that at home. And virtual classes are being dropped so that we can use for onboarding new members. And one more time, your failure to plan does not constitute my emergency. Have a spectacular day. Enjoy the eclipse if that's what you're doing. And we will see you in class. Have a great day.